Silverwood, our head coach. So, yeah, the floor is yours. Uh, Sri Lanka hasn't announced their ODI squad yet. What is the reason? I have no idea. Uh, I have no idea to be honest. I don't deal with the press releases, so I can't answer that unfortunately. So how do, you, how do you uh, uh, take this series uh, uh, before, before, before the ODI series? How is the preparation? Because you are putting down different series. Your momentum is in, in your way. It is. Um, I mean obviously we're going to take the series very seriously, as I'm sure both teams will. Uh, we're in a new cycle now, so we're, again we're building towards a style and brand of cricket that we want to play in the next World Cup. And that's something that we're trying to embed within the team, and this again is part of that process of doing that. So that seems exactly what we'll be trying to do. We'll be trying to continue the momentum that we've had from the series at home as well in Sri Lanka, uh, where we played some fantastic cricket. Uh, and I'll be encouraging the guys to go out and do the same thing, so have a batsman to go score big runs individually and as a team, so let's put those big scores on the, on the, uh, the scoreboard. I and mean, then also the bowlers to keep uh, producing their skills and keep getting better and better. And this is yeah. 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 Coach, uh, you talked about, talked about the new cycle, but uh, in T20s you have the t World Cup right practice year, and in the test you have the test championship, but you wonder there's no more Super League anymore, as it was in the last, before the last World Cup. So does it take away the competitive edge of it? Not in our mindset, no. I mean, we're still going to do the same things. Uh, obviously, we want to win the next World Cup and we want to try and give ourselves the best uh, possible chance of doing that. But that preparation has to start now. Uh, so that's exactly what we're doing. So that's how we will be approaching this. Please, uh, in recent past year, Bangladesh and Sri Lanka have been a good rival. Uh, it is starting with us, Trophy, Nagin Dance, Spain, it's come to time out. So how will judge this rivalry? Uh, the, the rivalry is, is obviously great. I think we need good competition. And as I said about the T20, uh, it was two good sides. You know what I mean? But we're going to play some competitive cricket. And I expect exactly the same again in this, this tournament, uh, in this series. So that's what I'll be looking for, some strong cricket being played. Uh, and obviously both teams will be looking for the same, I should imagine. Another part of Champions Trophy. So how do you motivate yourself uh, in Korea format? Well, I think the motivation is there. You're playing for your country. I mean, I think you've seen on the field that there's two passionate teams playing for their countries. And I think, you know, I mean, pulling on that badge knowing you're representing your country is motivation enough. Uh, and that's exactly what we feel in our dressing room. So the motivation is there. Obviously, we're, as I keep saying, we're building towards trying to win that World Cup and making sure we give ourselves the best opportunity to do so. So we're going to continue to build our team in that fashion. How do you see Kushan Mendes as a leader? Well, I think the results speak for themselves so far. What we have seen is him lead very well on the field. Tactically, he's made some good changes, yeah, made some good bowling changes, manoeuvred his field well. Uh, obviously, he's, he's still early into his uh, captaincy, but so far, I think everything's been positive uh, and we've seen some good results. Uh, coach, uh, look like a great top. Uh, what are your thoughts on uh, this weekend? It looks good to be honest, it, just, it has got a tint of green to it. It'd uh, be interesting to see when I go have another look at it today if that's changed from what I saw yesterday. <clears throat> but I think what, we'll, what it is firm underneath, so I think we'll see some runs scored on this. Uh, so that's, I mean, what the curator is expected as well, having spoken to them. So I think it'll be a good wicket. Yeah, uh, Cheetah has always been a high scoring ground that probably suits your team batting style. From the, with the momentum from the T20 series, would you consider yourself the favourites of the series? Well, as I said in the T20, I mean, we always go in believing we can win, uh, but equally we respect the opposition knowing that they're a very capable side as well. Uh, so we'll make sure that we do our preparation well, uh, which we have done, and we'll try and continue that momentum. As you said, uh, quite rightly said in your question, we've experienced some good batting scores uh, recently, so we'll keep trying to push that, and we've also seen some incredible individual contributions to that as well, so I'd like to see more of that from the players as they continue to learn to score big scores, so it's great. Coach, uh, uh, what do you think about the coming of the World Cup? Uh, I think he thoroughly deserves it. I think what we've seen in the T20 series has been very, very good. Uh, but to be fair to him, ever since I every time he's got an opportunity, he's taken it. So, you know, I mean, again, he's done that. So we have to give him all the credit. He works incredibly hard. 
Uh, he's very diligent with his preparation, and I think he's getting. I mean, he's got the results he deserves. Uh, also, yeah. yeah. Uh, first of all, we have not got the squad uh, yet, but uh, according to the wicket, uh, you know that wicket I uh, you know, chapter down. Uh, what would be your bowling combination? What could be? It's not uh, that you have to tell the specifics, but what would be your bowling combination? Oh, I don't think much will change from what we've seen in the, the previous few games that we've played against Afghanistan. I don't think much will change. Uh, how crucial Patum came back to score? Uh, oh, massive. I mean, I, I spoke earlier about I mean, indi fantastic individual contributions, and I think I mean you're speaking about Patum in, in particular. I think what he achieved in Candy was nothing short of exceptional. Uh, and obviously we were all very, very pleased from him addressing him. What he has done, he's gone from strength to strength in, you know, in the recent past and he's become probably one of the most consistent performers within that batting lineup. So he's, he's a key member of that batting lineup. So it's great to have him here. Okay. Good. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you. Sri Lankan Airlines, where the pride of taking you to the world excites us every day, where service is intuitive and indulgence is encouraged. Our care is inherent. This is where the world comes home. Thank you for flying Sri Lankan Airlines. You're our world. Karan Kapuane, Karan Piat Light, Vienna, Tatin, Hill Green, Electric Rechargeable LED Bulb, Motoragana, Vitulibale, Nometu, Hatra Pura Delvene, Wasaka Wagaki Maksai, Eka Mobile Bear, Green Electric, Ratam Eliai, Permit Yenihelai.